Hey everybody, the Green Pikmin ZX7 on here, and I am here with my first opportunity to make a game tutorial. I uh, kind of forgot the title for a second, but uh, this is going to be on the input number command, which is basically what I decided to do. As you saw in the tutorial, there were there was basically a locked door, right over here, and we had to go up and solve this puzzle out. Now, you may be thinking, oh, that number was actually not really correct. If that number is actually 686.6 repeat 7. So, um, just a reminder, there was no that was in that input number. So, uh, let's get this started, shall we? I'm gonna wanna make an event or a right before. If you wanna know where the input number is, it's really right here. I wanna make sure that there is a bail variable for that number. Which is right there. And the number is just some of the number of numbers. And yes, we subsize the number of digits to be entered. So in this case, it's input number, variable 1, 686.675 digits. Now, some people will not really know what the heck that would actually be, because... Well, hey, that top right plus top left on bottom right to so find by bottom left is actually an idea from the Wizard's house, so don't blame me. I gave hints to players, so... Might want to put the additional branches when the player is facing up and not anyone else because that would be most likely to be the stupidest thing. Unless it's to the right. Unless it's at a different wall angle, then you can do it. But I'm just going to put it up and down for these examples. And just put nothing else in the else. You can set some types of boxes if you want, but I mean. Meh. Anyways. When that happened. You want to make a conditional branch after the input number to make the variable equals itself. So when it it does add, it'll play the sound effect. It waits for 30 frames. This will actually the text will show up, and then the controls which will be on, which will evolve this door to be open on the switch. So it'll just go through like a normal door, and right for there. Although I could have set that to a different location, but hey, it's the same map. I don't really care. There's nothing much here, but I think this might be something else. Blind the grass. This is just a number puzzle. So, um. Yeah, that is pretty much it. If you like this tutorial, go ahead and hit that like button. Possibly subscribe. And leave a comment if like the tutorial. I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye!